student waiting area. A good spot to wait. Our boat is down this ramp there, Red Fin 3. Over that way is the marina and toilets are that way. Uh, and that's the dirt car park where your bus can come in to unload all your gear. Back around to the harbour. This is the boat Gundu Spirit. Gundu Spirit meaning child spirit. Uh, when we come past, students will hand their bags up on the front. There's storage gear under the front there, and the storage area over the other side. And then students will proceed to the back door. And through this back door, they'll hop aboard. You can see in here there's the toilet, toilet either side, a little rubber duck on the back, um, and plenty of space to sit down. Uh, can hold 50 plus the skipper and crew. You can see there's a, a widescreen TV that we have that shows all the skipper's instruments, uh, and there's the helm with all the skipper's instruments there. So coming back around through the front door, looking back, and here's all the storage compartments up the front. One under there, and over there as well. That's Gundu dropping us off on Sandy Beach. Usually have the tractor heading up there, trailer comes down to uh, load. Sort of need all the help of the students and teachers to get the gear off the boat. And Gundu will go out here and moor up. So you can see Moat Point there. On the sandy beach. So this is the welcome to country. A bit of an idea where we are. We're up here, Konami. So walking up to the centre. These are our outriggers canoes. This is our double that you can see, uh, and then one of the singles. So this is North Cap Isle Environmental Education Centre. Just here is the admin. Uh, within admin, uh, through over here is the first aid room. Up through here, in the kitchen, we have later, longhouse, student accommodation down the front here. Cultural cabin. Uh, this building here is our dry lab. Uh, the dry lab has a number of microscopes uh, within it. Uh, this is used for our plankton trawling and macroinvertebrate study. So this is our dining facility uh, run by our, uh, contract caterers. Uh, usually fit about 50 or so inside here. You can see quite a large space, um, the servery, that door there goes up. Uh, as we come along in here, this is the wash-up zone, uh, the scullery where the students wash their, their gear up. As we come around, we've got a, a data projector there and a screen. As we come out, you can see this is a veranda, another good spot to sit. Coming down, we can see we've got a dining area here as well, up with the outside tables. Um, then as well, we have our, our pizza oven uh, on request. We can light the pizza oven up and cook pizzas. We have uh, a volleyball net and volleyball court. Uh, and this is the longhouse in here where we do our briefs. Uh, currently, for the holidays, we're storing our red inflatable that we use at times in activities. Coming around here, you can see our, the longhouse uh, inside here. In this room here, we have the classroom, uh, wetsuits and stinger suits. Uh, gives you a bit better idea of the accommodation. Uh, we'll go have a look at an accommodation. 
So these are our accommodation cabins. As you head up here, um, a lattice area for drying off stinger suits or wetsuits. Uh, the composting toilet is located outside on each of the cabins. So it's a composting toilet. Um, as we come along here, they're currently being painted at the moment, so you need to excuse the mess. Um, so we have place for students to sleep out here. Each of the rooms, there's bunk beds in the rooms. Back over this way, you have your bunk bed as well in this, in this room. Uh, back this way is your bathroom with your shower, a vanity. There's a little alcove area here where the students, sometimes teachers sleep in the alcove area. And then they've got these beautiful murals you can see up in all the cabins. And one of the best parts is when you open these front doors, the view from the cabin is straight out there. So straight out we have, straight off here is uh, Reef Beach. Uh, reef Beach is a reef uh, a couple of hundred metres out. It's a high tide at the moment. There's a reef where we do our introductory snorkeling sessions on. So that gives you a bit of an idea about uh, the accommodation. So we head up this way. You can see that's the wreck cabin where we keep our PFDs and other equipment, rafting. Uh, as we head up this way to the rotunda up on the hill. You can see we have um, the LED solar street lights. Um, so this is the rotunda up on the hill. Sometimes groups use this when they're camping. Uh, there's a stove, gas stove and barbecue there. Some seating area. Down on the flat is uh, where we have our campfire. Uh, it's also the spot for the helicopter uh, rescue if we need to get the helicopter in. So that gives you a bit more of an idea. See the seating up here. If you've got any further queries, you can go to our website 